I'm here to be informed, uh, informed by the people who serve in the frontline ministries. I get to hear about their ministries firsthand. I get to talk to them, to listen to them, and to get to know them. So that is a, a tremendous bonus. Nothing motivates me personally more than uh, talking to someone about the ministry that they are doing. That, that helps me to realize that the world is much broader than my personal myopic vision. There is a lot of hurting and needy people out there which I tend to forget on a daily basis and, and prayer days like these ones, 2020, they, they remind me of, of, uh, of those needs out there. Uh, they don't let me forget that there are people out there who need our ministry and I'm very grateful for the opportunity to be here and see that. So our experience in, in Madwana, I know of the there was a Celebrate Recovery uh, uh, group there, but I didn't know how extensive it was. And there are so many Celebrate Recovery uh, groups that are meeting in Latvia. And how wonderful this is, because it's a great program that touches people's lives, can change their life through scripture, through practice, practical uh, skills, practical application. And that touches people in the Teen Challenge. Uh, group. Getting kids, getting young adults that are at risk that are right on the cusp of being in prison and once they come out of prison they are looking for resources and so yeah meeting these people, praying together, talking, having these these open honest hard discussions of what what are your needs? What, what can we be praying for? How can we partner with you after this? Um, what's 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 next for you? Uh, what are your struggles? What are you know, spiritual attacks, financial struggles, health? Just all these things that we can pray about and talk about, and it's just, yeah, it's it's very encouraging to have all these people that have this heart that God has 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 placed uh, with us for working with people uh, that are coming from hard places and people that hurt. I have more in common with you than I do with my own biological brother. But in my eyes, you are beautiful. Because together, we make up the church. And I just wanted to say that I see God's fruit in you. And Jesus said, we'll know them by their fruit. This was my first prayer days. Before, I thought it's an event where people come together to pray what they feel from early morning to late night. But it was not like that. It was more about participants and their stories. There was time for presentations, time to pray, and time to get to know each other. And their needs can be solved just by being together and praying. As simple as that. Hello from